What's your name? We haven't even introduced ourselves. Yeah. Joe. 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 Joe? Yeah. I like that mystery when it comes to the interviews. Mystery? You're a very oh, mysterious yeah, guy, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The best thing is there's people protesting over there about Chinese man. Oh, is it? And they're like, what are you doing here tonight? I was like, I like Chinese man. <laughs> I fucked up on CBC News. Yeah. I, I was like, I news. like, <laughs> hey, no, don't fuck her right in the pussy. No. <laughs> I'm sorry. Wow, no, okay, I'm really okay. sorry. Okay, cut second. this out. Let's start again. Let's start again. Well, no, you already said that. That was like, no, that was like an on the man, spot. I'm on CBC tonight on saying I love Chinese men. That's fine, man. <laughs> no, it's not. It's it is. My family's gonna be confused. It, I'm gonna get married to a white woman. <laughs> it, it just depends. It just depends what context they Dude, put you in. They're like, what are you doing here at venue tonight? Because there's people protesting about this French band called Chinese Man, oh, and Asian people are protesting the institute. Yeah. It's a bunch of French guys who make Chinese music because they love Chinese culture, and these bitches are protesting <laughs> yep. and they're protesting against it it's like they just like Chinese music they yeah, love Chinese that. culture yeah. like that's why they make the music man it's a beautiful culture yeah. it's beautiful Chinese culture is so rich and so much value and then they asked me what I'm doing here and I was like I love Chinese men and I was like fuck that's what okay. am I doing? That's, it's all good. Most of my audience are foreigners, so like, yeah. Okay. Kind of Vancouver Sushi. Konnichiwa. The Labrigio, the end, we have a lot of drivers, that are like students that drive Labrigis to like oh, yeah. school. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's to just classes. like a, a first car, they're just like, to yeah. go to class. They crash, to go it, to class. They crash it, daddy buys a new one. Yeah. 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 A lot of satellite kids. Uh, Google that. Have you been to Asia? Have you been to. I haven't, but. Do you want to go? I want to go. Yeah. I want to go to Indonesia. Okay. I had a trip to Bangkok like this because I was doing a business. I started oh. a business a couple of years ago and uh, only reason it didn't work because the Caribbean wasn't ready for it. It was biodegradable food and beverage products. Okay, okay. So that's what I was doing. And so you were in Bangkok for like how I long? didn't get to go because uh, what happened is two financial advisors said yes and then the second one, the third one was like brought a portfolio this big brought a projector and a PowerPoint. Why this wouldn't work in Barbados? I was like, uh, ah. okay. So that's kind of why I didn't end up in Bangkok, but uh, I really want to go. Check um, it out. Check it out, yeah. see what it is, you know? What, what do you hear about Bangkok that, that's making you want to go there? Um, Business-wise, what I've heard about Bangkok is, uh, it's very organized on that level. But I also know that as much as everyone says the pretty and fancy business stuff, there's stuff that other people don't talk about. Poverty, and that yeah. sort of stuff. Yeah, yeah. And that needs to be addressed. If you're this rich, you don't need to be selfish. But if you want to provide for your generations to come, you have to be selfish yeah. mentally. Not uh, mentally as in terms of like your, what they call it, legacy. But uh, for me, yes, you deal with a legacy, but also you need to with the real root the people that actually make it sustainable are the poor people mm. or, or the middle class as everyone calls yeah them. the workers that work yeah the workers okay so that's kind of for me what? what it is I've never seen it I've only seen it on the internet which is like beautiful yeah and, uh, but I've heard a story recently uh, this guy went to China and I uh, he come he came back humble so that means you know he saw he experienced some stuff, some stuff yeah, yeah that yeah. you don't usually see here mm -hmm. that's that's true this yeah exactly okay so, that's it